The resulting shot was deep, skidding low, and Kiefer with his best shot, the backhand, could only put it in the bottom of the net. It's one of those sort of approaches when you see it coming, you can almost just catch it and say, too good. So it's Emmen who returns beautifully against the incoming German. And with a couple of chances to turn this set on its head. exceptionally well on the break points. Because Hemant has had more chances than his opponent today. But he's just, as you can see, managed to take only three of them. A couple of times in the match, Hemman has chip, chipped and charged on the ad side, but on the break points when he's had a couple of second serves, he's sort of just chipped and stayed back, hasn't gone after it. Yeah, that one just not producing enough stick on the ball. Oh. Now let's see what he does with this second serve. more with it on the forehand and again an aggressive purposeful point from Hemman. Now taking a sip of water of course. Pete Sampras is a former coach. Yes, Hemman takes the break point. He's fought hard in this match, and he's got something out of that game. British number one ahead of break in the second set, 4-3. Four games to three, second set. In a minute, he's going to say, You sexy bees! See, once you've been to a few premiers, you know what to expect. Of course, I used to get invited to a screening every other night. But now I've cut it down to, oh, I don't know, say, 300 or so premiers a year. I don't have to leave home to catch a single one of them. Don't stop. Round the clock. Multistar 24-7. 365. Hundreds of movies to match your mood. Sky Movies. And away those courses go. But what dastardly deed is this? Shortcut. Now, what's he up to? Uh oh. Bye bye. But watch this. Black Sapphire heads for the finish post. The post really finishes him. Luckily, courses have free insurance and start from 6995. Interesting little exchange there between Hemman and uh, Paul Anaco just it's looking on. over in the corner and Anaco was sort of pointing with his finger down saying right here let's just take control of this match. Yeah and it's an important set for Hemman. No one wants to be down two sets to love and obviously ride this break through this set.
Taylor. Oh, it's a great stretch. Lovely balance and poise from Hemant. Good to love. Really should have done a whole lot better with that. And yeah, that's quite a return. And Hedman practically used a shovel to dig that one out of his toes. Fortunate to win the point. third love service game and he consolidates that break with some ease and it has been a match of momentum and Kiefer starting so brightly up takes the first four games him and then hitting back he took six out of the next seven games and then all of a sudden Kiefer gets on a run and he takes five out of six games and now him himself on a run of four straight games you want to try and explain that one I can't You were the expert on uh, all tennis related matters. Don't assume anything. Has Hemant got the balance right of attacking the net? I think so. I think any time Kiefer hits a second serve, somehow you have to make him feel like he has to react and come up with something very special. And that approach shot wasn't even particularly good, but it earned him the point. So that has the dual effect of chipping away at his confidence even more. Smart pass by Keeper. Didn't try and rip it, but just guided it down there. No real pace on it. Well, but even if Hemming got his racket on it, it was going to be tough to gener generate a winner from that position. See, that's where that consistent attack on the second serve can earn you points like that. You might lose one, but you might be gifted another. So adept at making people play a lot of balls off the first serve. Back in 2000, led the tour in that particular category. And now, Hemman with a chance of levelling things up.
Yes, and Hammond takes it on his first opportunity. What a close of the net. Breaking keeper for a second time. And the score line between England and Germany reads one all. Video player, bright color display, Bluetooth connectivity. In the Nokia 6230 phone. Nokia, connecting people. ZR and ZS from MG. Life's too short not to. Back to the Arthur Ashe court shortly, where it's one set apiece now between Tim Hemmond and Nicholas Kiefer. Georgie Thompson will be back tomorrow afternoon, one o'clock, with highlights of day eight, the night session there on Sky Sports 2. A couple of world number ones in action this evening. Justin Enenarden against Nadia Petrova of Russia. Roger Federer against Andre Pavel, both of those fourth round encounters. Then I'll be back for day nine, live and interactive Sky Sports 2, the place four o'clock the time for the first of the women's quarterfinals. Back to Ash, one set apiece, Leif Sharis, Marpeci. Kiefer just taking his time and taking a bath and break, trying to recover from the fact that England have equalized and what a set of tennis it was from Hemmen. I mean, he has, you have to say, really, since Fall Love Down, been the better player. But it was a, such a long way back from Fall Love Down for Hemmen. So keep a changing his shirt after this uh, match, obviously. There'll be a change of players, and what a couple it will be. It will be Andre Agassi up against Sargis Sargissian. Sargissian making uh, uh, plenty of headlines here for his epic run through. Firstly, five hours and nine minutes against Nicholas Massou in the second round. And then coming back from two sets to love down against Paul Henri Mathieu. Agassi, it has to be said, has a very healthy lead over Sargissian 5 0, but it should be a good contest all the same. As is this, Hemman to start the third. Drop it short and force keep it a run. It's going to have to be good because very few shots on a tennis court that the German can't pick up. Now this match has been reduced to a two out of three set match. The first two sets, ancient history. Yes, you learn from them, recognize your winning patterns, the plays that are working for you. But now this is becoming a little more of a sprint as you get halfway down the road at one set all. And one of four ancient men to be taken to the Arthur Ashe Stadium court today. Just four men who are age 30 or over, Andre Pavel up, as you heard from Chris Bailey later on today. Oh yes, well, Hemmer did well to react, but Keeper snaps off the pass. 